Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video, we're gonna be doing fire alarm testing at a middle school. This one was built in 1964 and is actually the one I once went to. It is a partially conventional, partly addressable system. It has an EST Quick Start QS4 fire alarm panel in it, and it is a sprinkler building. The sprinkler guys actually were working here at this school at the same time as we were doing our annual fire alarm. So they were verifying their flow switches and verifying their campers and their dry system and the portables which speaking of portables this school does have 11 portables it's actually quite hard for me to say 11 because it's kind of stuck in my head to say 14 or sorry i should say 13 they're labeled up to 14 or they used to be because they skipped number 13 as that one was removed a while ago but there was in total 13 portables there so as i'm just getting used to saying 11 now as the n2 where there's that temporary construction fence were removed and taken down to my school and guys I have a video on that project actually it didn't get many views which I wish it did because it's one of my favorite videos I've made uh, I thought that one turned out well anyways guys this school does have portables here and the school was built in 64 as I said and has several additions since then and this is going to be the last time you guys see this fire alarm system installed like this for an annual this will be my last year of me doing annuals in the schools regardless but it will be the last time i believe that this school ever gets its annual fire alarm testing done with the est quick start in it as i think later on this year maybe over christmas break i think that's when we'll put in a notifier system in this school to replace the est which that will certainly be a nice thing as i find notifier easier to work with i like working with their products in this video, not every single device was shown. I didn't show any of the sprinkler testing that was done. Uh, it's pretty simple, just flows and tampers, trip them, and make sure it comes up as the right thing. Other than that, there were some heat detectors, and most of the portables weren't shown in this video, as a lot of them either get really repetitive, or there was people and other trades working in those rooms that I don't necessarily know if they want to end up in a video, so I didn't record at all, as it was a kind of busy as uh, they're switching monitoring companies here anyways so those alarm guys were working out and around the school at various times to switch over to their new equipment and take over the alarm provide uh, service provided this video will start off with the fire bells going off as i'm not sure if it was a coincidence and a dirty detector set off probably not but we are standing there hadn't touched the system one little bit had just called into monitoring and the bells start going off as we're mid conversation so it's other this was extremely lucky that we just called in or maybe we somehow had a can of smoke open i don't know yeah they should have Unless something's actually going down, but I doubt it. <laughs> I didn't touch a single thing, did you guys? <laughs> and remember, they don't go solid red. They blink like every once in a while. We haven't even started testing. We literally didn't touch a single thing. We were just standing. We were just standing there talking about testing and the bells ring, all the doors shut. We just went on the full alarm. We had literally just put the school on test five minutes ago. No, I didn't. When I touched it, there was no smoke in the pole. All right. Someone so farted over here? It in so far and it went yeah, <laughs> this one's tested though. Did I just leave that in? <laughs> we are starting in this section up here where I have to take my shoes off because they are stripping the floor to wax. It can't get it any dirty. So we're gonna get the section done with first. Upstairs. How many smokies in? Two, zero. We just got a new solo kit too. New smoke, new heat, bunch of new poles. It's nice.
That was me. This will still go off though. Oh, shit. We're now back down on the first floor into the dance studio. I don't think it's my. Yeah, here comes. Which phone, which radio do you have? Hey Jamie, these ones are in the same zone, so I'll need a reset between. You know what, I see the problem here, and you guys will tell me all about it, but end of the day, it's not my problem. I'm verifying the fire alarm is correct, and there's nothing I can do about this. They don't listen to us. We wait for the fire department to write them up. So look, I get it's a problem, but Nothing I can do, it's out of my power. Okay, great. Because they're addressable and this is on its own zone so we can do it. Because then if we pile them up, we won't have real arms, right? But if you do the pole, don't you need to reset? Uh, if it's on the same zone as one we've previously done, yes. Yeah. yeah, well, she didn't really need to. Finish off this zone down here and then okay. go up. So two more in this. Other end of the corridor, outside room one through one one through, sorry, 1045. I got both numbers, both numbers on this freaking map. <laughs> is there one up in here? Yeah. And the pull station. So I'll leave those to the end. That way the smoke has dissipated a little more. See, so I got a method to my madness here, believe it or not. Do I need to do a map? Smoke yeah, this smoke two poles then move up to that section where they were putting that stuff on the floor. After this one, we're going to do a pole station and you will have to reset after the pole station. After, yeah, I could, should be still able to set this one off. Okay, she'll have to reset now. Reset. Must have been. That's rare around this place. They are pretty steep. We're now going up to do the section that they were working in, where they got a bunch of water on the floor and stuff.
Wait, just re we'll reset after we get all three done. So, when it comes to pull. So, I did that wing already. I came down up to that one. Find that one any better? It seals really good. It yeah, seals on the detector nice. nice. Um, no, I should be able to do it. Well, if we haven't reset after that zone, yes, we will. Remember, you reset after the first pull. I know. Since that's working at the panel, we're gonna move her to the front of Ned Cedar since the cell service in this concrete room and radio is just terrible. Well, I think we talked about that too. Like Same when, thing, only quicker. When we replace the system, right? We'll. We're not going to put them back if there's no heads. Let's ahead. just take them off today before the end of the day. We want to see if this thing will blow it up. We just want to see what's going to happen. Let me use this, this once. Coffee? Where did I do my... I don't think it's going to do it. Oh, there it goes. Usually it takes too long and then it pops because it overheats. Right. Yeah, I know the solo is not good for the Edwards. I got a feeling it's going to do the same thing. Oh, look at that. One one. Yeah, but is that because we changed it. that so it blows it up and stuff? Thinking. Yeah. Turn that light on, those exit signs will come on. I missed a couple smokes back there. I didn't film them. I'm gonna get in trouble. Hey, f hey, flip that switch on so I can see the exit signs. I don't have a switch here. No, yeah, right there. <laughs> nice. Exit signs are lit now, Peter. I can't believe you'd do that. Well, just keep it, keep it silent. It'll, my pole station will still go off. This one here is still in the red. But I can still activate this guy. No, because you activated over here. No, but if she's reset it, it's fine.
it's not if we're not reset. Where do we want to start? Let's go back down to those other fire doors outside the library and work our way this way. There's a pull station down there. I can do the pull right here. I haven't reset it though. It should still go. Yeah, you did that one. If you just leave it silenced, I can do the pull. Yeah, well, if, I, if it's silenced, I can still hit it. What time did you get there at?
I'll knock out all these pulls. Thank you. Why don't they just do a sleepover in the hallway? That way they have some pictures anyways. Yeah, but I, I always say that, like, we have to come up and put these smoke alarms up for sleepovers. But, like, if they did their sleepover... sleep over in here we wouldn't have to put anything up right mm -hmm. or does that not count i think it would sure. it's a smoke detector shut so I had to slam it when I slammed it it broke did Just did these three in there. We did this one.
Ring, 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 ring. The bells are bypassed now because the sprinkler guys are working in here, so they bypass it for their stuff. So we've just left it bypassed. We're heading into the back of the gym now, back of the stage area. There's a smoky over there. Did we turn the bells back on, Jamie? Okay. Oh. <laughs> we hit opposite ends of the three way at the same time. If I hear if I do this, I can make sure the bell works in here. Probably scared the sprinkler guys. I kind of do. Like magic. This room, the little room in the girls' changing room. Paper, paper storage room. 1072. 1072. Go look at the mixing system up with all your. No, you don't know how it works. You don't know. Oh, I do. Fuck you. Mix them. There are heats at the top of those mechanical spaces, that but they might be fixed. Now it's going to be a smoke when you reset. It will go anyways. But it's not on an SLC, is it? It is, yep. Yeah, she didn't need to reset after the last one. That's fine, those guys are here. Here it comes. Okay, I guess it went. Unless that's your smoke that keeps going. And all electrical room. G365, this is the ones you can see, eh? Now going to test the portables. Man, I turned my keys on. <laughs> there's a pull station in, in each one of these bathrooms, and then there's two in that building. Those all just got done off camera. Intrusion alarm guys are working on this building, switching it over to a different company. I 
I'm going to accept that. Your keys again. Portable has a pull station. You know reset. But these two are gone. I have a video on that. That one didn't work for years. We got it fixed though. Yeah, a little bit. Our portables, we're missing two of them. Felt a raindrop on my head. Oh, this one sounds like crap. I remember. That. What? Yeah. one in the furnace room. Last portable, portable 11. I think the strobe is all broken there, Jamie. It works. Yeah, it's broken. I mean, it kind of flashes.
Okay, I got three more heat detectors in this one, and then that's it. Yeah, it really doesn't need to be here. I don't know why they didn't do this when they did seismic and sprinklered it. I mean, the portables are a little different since they're not permanent, but. That was close. That's always a panic move, isn't it? You pull it away so fast and you break. Nah. Oh yeah. Alright, we're all done at this school. A lot of stuff was done off camera, but just because there's people around, not everyone wants to be in a video. Anyways guys, that's it for this school. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.